Hey guys, my name is Jan. Today we're gonna be talking about the newer Q3 TTL flash speed light with the Q trigger for Canon. The Q trigger is designed with 45 degree tilt, giving the user a clear view of the screen at both high and low angles. The Q system is powered by a lithium battery that is powered by 3200 milliamperes. The Q system has a built-in TTL function that calculates the right exposure value of your subject. Both the Q trigger and the Q3 are made of high quality materials that give comfortable and natural feel in the hand. The materials used for the Q system also absorb the light in order not to affect the, the shooting environment. The Q flash trigger can control up to five groups of Q3 flashes through a grouping function allowing for a simple and rapid configuration of the lighting settings with each group. So first of all, switch on the button. Then you got different buttons in here. You got the mode, slave, the grouping or the channels, high speed sync, and you got your test button. For you to control the power of the flash, you have the dial on the side. You can bring it up to one out of one power or one out of 28 power. With a fully charged battery, the Q3 has an exceptional level of autonomy, allowing the photographer to take more than 500 photos. The standard lithium battery can be easily replaced. The Q3 adapts effortlessly to most shooting environments and scenes. In addition to that, the Q systems also support a high speed synchronization up to 1 out of 8000. When using 2.4 GHz wireless QC trigger, Q3 Speedlight Monolight is compatible with Canon eTTL cameras. QC trigger has a total of 5 groups and 32 channels that supports TTL auto flash, multi flash manual flash and flash exposure compensation. 